Okay. Yeah. Now you can, okay, yeah. yeah so here's um, just uh, the agenda, the program timetable of our uh, two day workshop. Uh, as you can, uh, I already sent you uh, this file. So you, and uh, here I just give a very short uh, presentation of uh, our company uh, uh, researchers and uh, um, maybe I can explain why, what we are doing and uh, why we are part of this uh, uh, project Optimex. Um, yeah, uh, actually the plan was uh, to in, uh, welcome you physically in Linz and uh, in Hagenberg where our uh, company is uh, located. But uh, as you all know, the situation uh, doesn't allow us to do it. So here I just show you some picture from the city Linz and uh, the Johannes Kepler University in Linz and here also in the Sofia Park Hagenberg and our company on the right picture where I'm also now sitting here. And uh, just a bit uh, historical point uh, of our research company. So our company uh, originate from the Mathematics Institute, uh, have a similar name, RIST Institute. And RIST is the acronym for Research Institute for Symbolic Computation. And uh, after the foundation of uh, the Software Park in Hangberg, so Hangberg is a, a small uh, call a city in a, a 20 kilometer away from Linz. And uh, two years after the foundation of Software Park Hangberg, uh, our company was, found, uh, was uh, founded by Professor Bruno Buchberger. And uh, the idea of the, the foundation of uh, this company is that uh, um, um, we want to bring the, or we want to bring the mathematical knowledge and also the, the way of uh, solving problem in mathematics to industry and uh, with the use of sophisticated uh, softwares. And uh, first we start with uh, tackling problems in engineering, logistic production, and uh, from time to time the new research area appears like uh, in medical informatics and uh, data analysis, da data management, uh, and so on. And uh, our company is the, to most part belong to the Johannes Kepler University and uh, to, uh, to a small part to the state of Upper Austria. And here are some numbers describing the company. Uh, we have nearly around uh, 80 employees with different backgrounds in mathematics, uh, physics, uh, computer scientists, and nowadays also more in data scientists. And we public in the, publish in scientific journals, and uh, uh, for this we have to have lots of scientific partners from industry and uh, uh, research institutes. And here I just show you some uh, reference uh, partner, what you uh, had, uh, have and also uh, are having. Uh, now, like uh, here you can see uh, Airbus, uh, First Alpine, or the German Aerospace Centers, and uh, and so on. And uh, for solving the problem, our company is divided in uh, is divided in four units. So um, here with different colors, as you see, a unit for data management and analytics, where you where we uh, solve problems uh, with. Uh, uh, recent uh, method in the machine learning and data analysis, and uh, and then orange, as you see, you can see here the unit for logistic informatic, and here we developed uh, software for planning and also use the mathematical optimization and simulation technique for uh, um, solving problem in control of process. And in blue, you can see the uh, unit for industrial software application where we uh, developed uh, software for engineering disciplines. And in red, you can see the unit for medical informatics. And here uh, we developed uh, software for uh, medicine. And uh, I just show you some, uh, some uh, example projects and uh, I won't go into details in each project. Like here in a unit for data management and data an analysis, uh, we uh, try to uh, collect uh, data and uh, predict um, things and also uh, doing a management of products and related information. 
and also doing ma uh, workflow management in food sector. And uh, here are some uh, project from the logistic uh, unit. Uh, here, for example, we uh, have a software tool for logistic planning in automotive in industry and also using mathematical uh, uh, problems, uh, sol um, uh, solving uh, problems, uh, solving solution to create a sustainable logistic uh, concept in food uh, uh, delivery, delivering and uh, also using mathematical optimization uh, in order to reduce the uh, uh, time and uh, cost in the uh, planning, machine planning. And here in the in medicine informatic, uh, we have uh, software for uh, objective uh, diagnosis uh, for uh, if a patient who get a, a burning uh, injury and also a software simulator software in uh, surgery, a neuro surgery. Um, it is where you can uh, train uh, future doctors. And uh, the next, uh, the, the last unit uh, here where I'm also working and where actually uh, the work uh, done for the project Optimex is done in this unit, is the unit for industrial software application. And here we have the uh, two, uh, pillars, um, uh, one for computational engineering and the other one for manufacturing uh, processes. And uh, here I just want to show you uh, also two examples. One, uh, for example, we implemented uh, integrated uh, uh, real-time collision avoidance system for uh, processing centers uh, with a, in cooperation with a company, uh, WFL. And uh, uh, processing center is uh, a big uh, machine where you uh, include uh, uh, milling process, drilling, and also turning process. And of course, the, a long -term, term cooperation with the company Airbus Defend and Space. Here we applied uh, uh, mathematical optimization technique, uh, especially structural optimization. And here we already tackle a problem with uh, one million uh, a variable and uh, try to uh, accelerate the uh, compute computational times and uh, the cooperation as i as i mentioned already lasts very very, very long and still lasting and uh, we are doing this since 2007 when we uh, restructured the system of uh, of airports and since 2010 uh, we become the uh, partner the de main development partner uh, for for the, for these systems. Yeah, and uh, I hope with these uh, few slides I uh, can uh, uh, persuade you that um, uh, the the topic uh, mathematical optimization uh, is the, always uh, a popular uh, research topic in our company from the uh, from the start from the founding in 1992, and uh, still uh, going on. And we are very, very happy uh, being a part of uh, the program Optimex. Yeah. So now I will give the words to Professor Dimitrios Kronopoulos from University of Nottingham. He will uh, uh, explain you, give an overview about uh, our project and uh, the network. So I now stop sharing and.